Hey, what's up everybody? It's Jared Gwines here at Dallas Vintage Toys. It is Thursday, February 4th, and the toys are still making all the noise. So let's go over here and talk to our man on the scene, Mr. Scott Tucker. Now, Scott, what's up, guys? say hello to our, our Facebook Live audience here. Now, Scott, what are you doing in the case here? And, and Jessica, I want you to go over here and really show what he's doing. Now, Scott has warned us that he doesn't always know the exact character names for every single character in here. But what, what, what's going on here? Is there new stuff? What, what are you putting out? Well, we just picked up a collection of uh, Build-A-Figures and some various both Marvel and DC figures. So I'm actually kind of reorganizing the case yeah. so it can make sense for our customers when they come in. So down here you have sort of like the Batman DC kind of universe um, and it kind of fades off. I mean, it's all DC and then up here is the next uh, shelf of DC figures. And then some of my favorite, Jared, are some of these pop culture figures up here. You got some, uh, it looks like uh, you've got, what is this, Ghostbusters, right? And uh, what was this guy? This is from Ghostbusters 2. What was his name again? Vigo. Yeah, yeah, the Vigo. <laughs> I, I was terrified of that guy when I was a kid because my dad was an artist, a painter, and he painted a lot of old world paintings. And so when you went down the hallways of my house, there was tons of these old looking paintings. Wow. And so Ghostbusters 2 terrified me because I always thought one of my dad's paintings was going to come alive and terrorize my sister and I. So. Yeesh. I see Arnold. I see, uh, I see Master Shredder, Aruku Saki back there. I see Le Aruku Saki. Leonardo. Uh, some different, is that, uh, what is, what is, is that uh, Mad Max? What is that? I actually don't know who that guy is. That's one of those. Yeah. One of those uh, more obscure ones that I don't know. Okay. But my yeah. favorite is probably the the uh, Jason, the video game Jason. Video game Jason. And is that like a real cloth? Is that like he looks like he actually has like an actual like material? Yeah, he's all cloth. Okay, that's cool. So uh, so down here it looks like we got some anime figures. So is that uh, you got uh, Master Roshi down there and uh, Sailor Moon or something like that, or or is that Street Fighter or something like that? What yep, that's uh, some Sailor Moon stuff, and then there's some various other uh, 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 figure arts. Uh, Godzilla? Yeah, and then I put them with the Godzillas, because yeah. they just kind of, they're all from the same part of the world, so. Look at uh, the guy in the white suit, that's, uh, that's a Marvel character, Kingpin. Big bad Kingpin over there, look, he's got his head in his hand. So we have three Kingpins right now. That's a Again, big, thick, that's a big, thick dude. We just bought a collection of Build-A-Figures, yeah. so uh, it's really cool to have three at the same time. But I'm sure they won't last. Kingpin is like me walking into Fogo de Chao. Like, I'm just like, House Picanha, flip to green. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Just getting, uh, yeah, just gonna get So you wear a white suit? Yeah, I wear a white suit. Yeah, little I wear a white suit, I shave my head, and then I just, you know, go in there and eat some House Picanha. That's what I'm doing. I used to have a really nice white suit, and then I spilled Chinese food all over it, so. Ooh, yeah, that one work. went to the Goodwill. Well, is there anything else anywhere else in the store? Because the name of this uh, this live stream we're doing today is New Toys. So we want to see the new toys. Where are the new ones at? Let's see the new ones. Sean was pointing us towards the, the green. Yeah, let's start, with the, let's start this way, Jessica. Let's just go this way. So Sean ordered these and uh, put them together. Pretty cool pieces. I'm going to set of these yeah. for myself, too. So. This he is has a set at each. home. So this. The Flasher Gremlin. The Flasher. And the brown gremlin. Yeah, the brown brown gremlin. Brown and then and gremlin. then and then E. T. And have you heard some of the newest rumors about E. T. They said that he was he's a Jedi. E. T. is actually really? E. T. is actually a Jedi. Yeah, he's in a Star Wars. Uh, so in Star Jedi. yeah, in Star Wars Episode One or Two, when they're two. in the Galactic Senate. Yep. If you pay attention to the background, one of the member races of the Galactic Senate is E.T. species. There's three or four of them. I didn't know that. And so the thing oh. is, if, so if E.T. species exists in uh, Star Wars, then that must mean that they can possibly wield the Force. I mean, he... he well, Lucas and Spielberg made a bet who close encounters of Star Wars would make more money, and George Lucas owned up, and he, uh, you know, still paid him to this day. Wow. What if what if what if E.T. is actually a Jedi? Leave a comment below. Is E.T. a Jedi? Is that why he wants to go home to continue his training? He would I mean he probably would be a Jedi because E.T. Yeah. wasn't exactly a bad guy. Guess well what? he can make he things just fly. To go home. Did he not use the force to help you know Elliot fly away on the uh Speaking of bad guys, someone stole our Reese's during the Lou Ferrick. No come on! If you stole our Reese's, bring it back on you, man. We yeah. actually hungry. We actually have you on camera. 
Yeah, whoever you are. Oh, you know who There's it is? There's a camera right there. Some person. <laughs> Let's see that camera, Jessica. Yeah. You stole, you stole <laughs> your own camera. You took E.T.'s candy, and he's... You know how hard yeah. it is to find a king-size Reese's yeah, you during cook. COVID? You stole two dollars worth of chocolate. Hey, don't steal. So we have okay? Fortress nice. of Fangs. What is that? Fortress also that chocolate. Like first time we've actually had that. You say it's a fortress, for, fortress of Fangs. 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 What, what? Dungeon Dragons. Okay. I'm going to let Sean and, take over on this one. We have a Tiamat right there, which is also Dungeon and Dragons, super rare. We uh -huh. have Clash of the Titans, uh, the Kraken, and the 1979 18 inch Kenner Alien. So That's those terrifying. Are probably four little grill pieces, and uh, they really don't come around too often. So. Amazing. Well, what else is new? Show us some more new. Oh, we got some uh, uh, Hot Joys Rambo figure. Uh -huh. This is uh, actually. I think 15 or 16 years old. So there's John Rambo, First Blood Part 2. This is 16 years old, but we just got it in? 15 years old. I yeah. never saw that. It's an old hot toy. And uh, that's the Iron Legions. Yeah, you can, new. you can do um, army building with those guys. And then we can go hit up Trevor to see what else is new. Okay, let's see what else is new. Uh, uh, we got some loose rentals. <laughs> Did we ever show off all the Mezcos? Um, no, we, we actually got, oh yeah, let me show him. We got him the other day, actually. We got the dark side. We got some, uh, a couple of Gomez's. Well, hello. Oh, right over there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> so these are, these are pretty nice, so. Yeah. What are you doing? <laughs> well, the mic is right there. Hello, so. hello, can you hear me? Sorry. And we got the 20 year Gomez over there. Hello, yeah. Seattle. 20 years one, and uh, I'm listening. But right, here's the back of it. He has like his cape and stuff. Okay. Wow. And, uh, it, well, it's pretty heavy. All these people. Pretty heavy. Pretty yeah. heavy. So those guys are. I, I'd be, I'd be yeah. really angry if I was born and my mom named me Darkseed. Like dark, dark Seed. Right. Dark Side. Oh, yeah, Side. It's Dark Side. Dark Side. Okay. Looks like I can just spell Dark that Side. That sounds like a right. beverage. Like a glass of Dark Side. I mean, these guys are all more. Yeah, let me have some Dark Side. Is everything else so but we've got just thousands and thousands of toys it's kind of out of control like there's so many toys you guys don't even know what toys are showing oh we got like, another look at those toys alien queen alien queen. queen oh that's actually that's been a few years since that's been out yeah oh and this one how much is this going for these days it's uh 199 now okay okay couple hundred okay and then i think Gotta there's another oh yeah. oh yeah we got some legos sure. some legos Okay. Okay. Yeah. Other, other new stuff. Millennium Ooh, Falcon. Ooh, look at that. Millennium Falcon. The Adat. We got Mega Man. And we got the, okay, so we got this in we got yesterday. There. We got here. Is that Andre the Giant? Don't do it, Andre. Oh, don't do it. Macho Man. We got some wrestling figures. Oh, yeah. Macho He's Man. Man. <laughs> He's so cool. Yeah. Whoa! Oh, the, the ultimate warrior. <laughs> man, what a terrifying. That was actual an actual human. I remember watching him as a kid, man, the ultimate warrior. Just like this 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 crazy dude. What a cool character. Mr. Miyagi? Rocky 3? Awesome. Crazy. We still live? Okay. Star Wars. Okay. So, any anything new over here in the Star Wars collection? What, what are these? I've never seen these Mandalorian. Look at these. These all these Mandalorian figures. Are yeah, we got this kind of Amazon movie. exclusives. Amazon exclusive. Cara Dune figure. These are kind of highly cool. Classic. We have we have a bunch of these. What are these? Just uh, in, Imperial Stormtroopers. Just, just a standard Stormtrooper, but they have like the updated bodies. So you could do the you could do okay. So you could do a lot of army building here with these standard Stormtroopers. These yeah, are pretty. We, these we are pretty cool. Is the last one, but we still got awesome. a handful. Okay. So come in here, come in here and get these. Now you guys are open here five days a week, right? Till, uh, yes, sir. Till, till six o'clock. Yes, sir. Uh, when, Wednesday through Sunday. Wednesday through Sunday, yes. Yeah, close Monday and Tuesday. Mm -hmm. Very cool. All of you guys, I don't know, how many people have got watching Jessica? 57. 57. So we have an arcade here at Dallas Ranch Toys. If you ever come in here to Dallas Ranch Toys, you can see we have a beautiful Blacklight Arcade. You can come in here 
and you can play your arcade games, Asteroid, Pac-Man, Centipede, uh, Stargate, Phoenix, uh, and these are for sale too, so if you want some, let us know, we can hook you up. Um, you can take an arcade home and get that in the back of your car. So there's so much cool stuff to see here, Transformers, G.I. Joe, He-Man, Voltron, Hot Toys, Sideshow, uh, it just goes on and on and on. A lot of people also don't know, uh, in store only, you can get 10% off on Wednesdays if you wear a Dallas Rangers Toys t shirt. But you got to buy the official t shirt from us and you got to wear it in on a Wednesday. It's the only way it works. Sorry, I don't make the rules. I just enforce them. Just kidding, I don't even enforce them. I'm just telling them. But on Wednesday, you wear a Dallas Rangers Toys t shirt, it'll take 10% off our already low everyday prices. So that's uh, really, really cool. Look at a bunch of vintage cards here Spawn, Adams Family, Star Trek. We got some awkward, uh, awkward bears up here. Indiana Jones, Star Trek, Gargoyles. Uh, top baseball cards, the real ones with actual bubble gum. I dare you to eat that bubble gum. So here's 1988 Topps baseball cards. You can win a trip to 1989 spring training. I don't know how that's gonna work. <laughs> Just cool stuff here. Just cool vintage stuff, vintage Legos, video games, action figures from the 90s and 80s and all over. And in between, Dallas Finish Choice is the place to be. Now, if you can't get in here, and, we, and you should get in here, because it's cool, but if you can't get in here, guys, Visit us online anytime. You can shop 24-7 at DallasFinishToys.com. I'll put the link right here in the video description. And we have free shipping for all orders over $100 inside the continental United States. So it's everyone except for our friends in Hawaii and Alaska. Sorry you're left out, but you already knew that. One of you guys is up there in Canada, and the other one of you guys is way out in the ocean, and you're probably not even worried about it. But the other 48 states, that includes you, West Virginia. I don't know why you're even watching, but if you're watching, West Virginia, that includes you. Somehow, free shipping on on. Uh, your orders of more than $100 from DallasVinishToys.com. You can shop more than 11,000, maybe almost 12,000 custom toys. Uh, well, not custom toys, but custom uh, photos, the descriptions. All those toys, the photos, are the actual photos of the actual toy. We don't use any stock photos. Even if we get the same toy over again, we take new pictures. So you're seeing the exact toy in the exact condition that you're getting it. So you can shop us online anytime, DallasVinishToys.com. Or visit us right here uh, at our store here in Dallas, Texas. Easy to find on Google Maps. Um, anytime. So, my name is Jerry Wines. Thank you guys for watching real quick. Sorry we couldn't get to your comments, but if you need us, you can give us a phone call uh, or you can send us a direct message here on Facebook. Uh, we're checking the messages all day long. We're responding to you as we can. So, we thank you for watching. We'll see you here right on your newsfeed for more Dallas Minutes Toys action soon.